Thanks for joining. Happy Mother's Day. Babe, if you're watching this, happy Mother's Day. Hi, right, if you're watching it, happy Mother's Day. All right, tonight is just, or today I was supposed to try to make this for breakfast, but um, the burgers didn't thaw in time, so now I'm making it for lunch. All right, so we're just going to make egg burger on the Blackstone griddle. Oh, before I forget. I feel bad because my friend uh, Red Banks is going live too. So I feel bad. Normally, he's he's a new guy in our group, cook group. Okay, I will put his channel link on the top of the top right of the screen. If not, I'll put it in the description below after I get done recording this, okay? But if you guys want to check out my boy Red Banks, please go check him out. He's another brother of mine. Uh, we both... Uh, we both serve different military, but we serve the same country. So you got to respect that. So make sure you subscribe to this channel Red Banks. All right, let's start off with bacon Can't go wrong with adding bacon to a burger. Actually, you can't go wrong just adding burger, period. <laughs> hey, Daddy Dutch Barbecue. Hey, thanks for joining, man. All right, then we're gonna put our hamburger patty. Yeah. So right now I have this side high and this one at a low setting. This is where we're gonna cook our buns. We are, make, we are cooking buns. Now, when it comes to a burger, you could do whatever seasoning you want. All right, I, I'm gonna add the rub. I'm gonna add rub into the burger. So that, that'll be my seasoning for today. I got this from Jason from GQ Barbecue. There we go. Let it do its thing. Let me get you guys closer. Check it out. Seasoning, got bacon, the sound. Gotta love the sound. Just the sizzling sound is just amazing, huh? Enjoy it, enjoy it. Hey, happy Mother's Day, people. If any mothers are watching out there, happy Mother's Day. Nah, if you're watching this, happy Mother's Day, too. Can't beat you can't beat that that thing is amazing I like how the color starts to change see it up close and personal without burning yourself all right 
Let's flip those bacon over. Like I said, flipping a bacon is an art form. You gotta get one of those pigtail flipper. You gotta ask Daddy Dutch where get it. I'll put his link below too. Daddy Dutch, since you're watching this, you could uh, comment and tell everyone where you got this. If you want. So windy right now. See? Perfect bacon. My kids don't like it too crispy. We're getting there. We are getting there. Okay, let's season the, this side. Same thing, we're gonna use the rub. All right, why? <laughs> the rub for everything. Ooh. So on this one, we're gonna go with medium. All right, so to the left, we will do the eggs and the buns. Let me season it. I know I seasoned it earlier before I started, but you know what? let me season it with butter. I'd rather do that. Can't go wrong with butter. Season it with butter. So that's medium right there. And this is where we're gonna make our eggs. Oh, I got a I got a list going this way. I kind of figured. So I'll start off right here. So this one slid this way, this one is just staying put. So what I want to do with these buns is before I do anything with them, I'm going to butter them. Let me see if I want to make sure you can see it. Not big. I'm just gonna throw some butter on the bread. Oh yeah. And we're gonna put my wife's favorite uh, seasoning on it. So here's how it's gonna work. We're gonna butter it. butter each side of the bun.
right? This is optional, but it's up to you, but I'm telling you it's gonna make the buns taste better. So put some garlic salt in them. Turn this down to the lowest setting. I think the bacon is definitely done. All right. Let me move these two. Move these down here. Push this down here. Okay. And I'm gonna set this to the lowest setting. We are done. All we're really doing is warming this this end up. And let's work on this egg. It's almost ready. Flip this over one more time. You can tell it's windy. Check it out. So, we've got bacon, we got the burger, we got those beautiful eggs that's ready to be turned over. Then we got some seasoned buns. All right. Not only are they buttered, but they're all, they also have garlic salt with it. I'm telling you, it's going to taste perfect. All right. Give it a couple of seconds and I'm just going to flip it over again. I want to cook it, but I don't want to cook it too, too much. There we go. That's the look I'm going for. Perfect. See how our buns are looking. Oh yeah. All right, let me set up. I'm gonna show you how we are gonna decorate these burgers. Are we gonna put it together? All right. Let your creativity run wild, okay? Just because I'm showing you how to, how I'm gonna make it doesn't mean you don't, you have to follow, but just get the basic idea. All right, here we go. Uh, let me turn this off. I think we're done here. Let me turn this off. I think we're also done. All right, let's decorate it. So first, do a boring one. Add some lettuce to it. Simple. Let's miss. We're playing it safe right now. Okay. So if you want to add pickles, you can add pickles. I, I'm not going to add any. But I do have some extra ones. You know what? Let's do this. Let's put some onions on the bottom. Right, onions on the bottom. Then tomatoes. What do you guys think? All right. The cheese. Don't worry about melting the cheese. The burger will do that itself. Okay. Let's give it some bacon. guys think so far let me zoom in let me zoom in that way you guys can have an idea and I'll bring it closer too. you see it you see where I'm going with this you know what I'm not trying to change the subject but I think I can bring you guys in closer 
I'm just working on my camera angles. Try to give you guys the best view I can. Let's see if I can pull it off. Let's see if I can do it this way. Oh, I could definitely do it this way. All right. So you have that so far. All right, and then we will put a bacon on top. And eggs. And then you have your burger. What do you guys think so far? Do you see it? Let me see if you can see, give you guys a view. See it? Look how beautiful that looks. All right, let's go with the second one. Second one, I'm gonna do a little different. I'm just gonna add a spread on there. So this is a in and out spread that I've learned from a friend. So right here, this is the, here, let me use this one. So this one is the in and out spread that a friend of mine um, taught me. All right. And I'll, I'll put it in the description below. All it is is like ketchup, mayo, apple cider. It's nothing big. Everyone always assumed it was something fancy, but when you showed me, Crazy over this. All right, so let's go with a different type of lettuce. Let's go with some shredded lettuce. It always looks good. Add onions to the mix. I can't see if you guys can see. All right, you guys can see. Onions to the mix. We can add our tomatoes. Let's be a little different on this one. Let's add some uh, Swiss cheese. Put a burger on there. Yeah. Then a couple bacon. Actually, since you're in that view, let me do this. Let me put the eggs towards you so you can see the yellow yolk. Look at that. You see that? It's tilting a little bit, but that's all right. All right, same thing with this one. You could put ketchup, mustard, whatever spread you want to add. But I'm going to use up the rest of it in and out spread. All right, I'm going to use the rest of it. Now you could add pickles too. My kids are probably gonna add pickles to it after uh, after I serve it to them. Same thing. Yellow cheese. Right, we're gonna add yellow cheese to it. You could almost see how the cheese are drooping. And we we'll add some bacon to it. All right, same thing. Egg on top. Let me have the egg facing you. Look at that. That is the most beautiful burgers you guys will ever see. Look at that. All three burgers. Oh, let me slide it together. There you go. All right. I might actually use this as a thumbnail. It's actually beautiful. All right, let me show you how I'm gonna serve it to my kids. Ooh. All right, so you got the burgers there.
Let's see, what do you guys have to say? Drooping, not drooping, or oozing. Are you guys live? Give me a shout out. Matthew Glendale, I'm giving you a shout out right now. Thanks. Hey, don't forget to check out my friend Red Banks. You got to check out. He's live too. All right. Do you ever try and melt cheese? I do, but I'm not a cheese guy. I'm not really. So let me show you. I really like this one right here. This is very beautiful. You know what? Let me go with this one. I like this one too. All right. So this is, it's it right there. There's more burgers in there. See it? So I hope you guys have an idea. I mean, you could copycat this ingredient, that's fine. You know, it's not like I invented it. But at the same time, create something of your own and let it be your own, you know? Let me show you the rest before I let you guys go. Here's the other two. And here's the one I'll be serving. Oh, that's a beautiful shot right there. All right. Hey guys, I just want to thank you guys for joining. As always, I'll put all the ingredients in the description below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, hey, Please subscribe to our family channel, and if you hit that bell button, I'll see you on the next live video. All right, happy Mother's Day, have a safe, safe weekend, and I'll see you next time. Bye.